Gang, what's good with y'all, man? Today we're going to a pop-up for Entire Studios, and I figured I'd pick up the camera and take y'all along. So that's what we got going today, man. I'll catch y'all there. So we had that Entire Studios pop-up. Hopefully, hopefully they remember me and let me in, but we're gonna see. Don't, don't get hit and try to cross, bro. Buddy at the at the entrance, but we're gonna wait till they open that joint back up. Yeah. Yo, seven. Uh, yeah. Just two of you. Yeah. Okay. Uh, second floor. All right. Is this joint, man? Coco, you and who else? Yeah, I was like, I got in, I was like, dang, I I'm 
money grab, I ain't gonna lie. Is there a decent?
Gang, what's good with y'all, man? We back at the crib with it. It's actually been a couple of days because that day was a little hectic. I'm not gonna lie. I ended up hosting at the end of that day. <laughs> And um, I really kind of barely picked up the camera and vlogged that, but, but that was like my first time ever hosting a club. I hosted at Apartment 200. It was actually pretty far. But I wanted to show y'all what I ended up picking up. Um, I actually have new pickups that I just haven't showed y'all yet. Like, look, I just got these rip pants. If you follow me on Instagram, you already seen these low key. Actually, yeah, no, nah, you already seen these low key, but I wanted to show y'all what I ended up getting from entire studios bruh so the deals was actually like really really good like i picked up three different jackets for 197 dollars total which in my personal opinion that's a steal because half of these jackets be like a couple hundred dollars on its own matter of fact i'm gonna check real quick and see how much so i think some of the jackets and stuff kind of start at like 350 to like 400 but some of the heavier like puffer jackets and stuff like that go for like 800 which i probably should have copped but i didn't end up grabbing too many things but the first thing that i got is this leather bomber jacket which is really really fire i'll do like a proper detailed um haul or something where you guys can like see it better but just to real quick show y'all what I got. I got this leather bomber crazy piece. I also got this puffer vest, which originally when I was looking through the rack, if you see it in the video, they had like a couple of different color, like tones of this, I guess you would say. Like this is the wider version. They also had like one that was more cream and stuff like that. And they also had the full puffer joints as well. But I ended up going with this because I don't really have a white puffer vest. I have kind of like a black one. But, um, I don't know, man, just when I see things that are white, because I have a full closet full of black, I'm always like, I might be able to use that one day. So, I don't know, I think this joint is really, really solid and definitely good for the price. These was like 40 bucks, bro. That's, you can't beat that, honestly. And then this is like this super heavy duty, um, like faux fur type of, I don't even know what you would call it. It's just like a big fur fleece or something like that. Like the inside is super, super cozy. I don't even know if y'all can see for real, but definitely a half zip, but like the cut on it, since it's cropped and really, really bulky, I feel like a big old bear in this joint or like a black abominable snowman or something. I don't know. Is that even how you say that? Abom abominable snowman? Adom abominable snowman? Y'all know what I'm be trying to say, bro. But that's pretty much it for the pickups. What I do gotta do though, is I gotta prep this launch for this necklace, bro. So this right here is called the Twilight Cross Necklace. I was kind of trying to find out what I should name it for the past couple of days. And I came up with Twilight Necklace just because, but it got the stones in it. So it shines and it sparkles. So I was like, Twilight. You know what I'm saying? Like that just made sense. I also like put into chat GPT like different names and stuff. And I seen that and was like, that's the one right there. So it will be dropped. Matter of fact, no, it should be out by the time that this video goes up, but had to get the, the cases and all that. So we got the packaging set in there. We got the dust bag and the this is probably like low key one of the best little setups I got. This is a new type of, I mean, it's not a new box, but it's a new type of box that i haven't purchased before so everything is set up for this literally all i gotta do is like weigh it on the scale make sure that um all of the shipping calculations and everything is correct and then um it'll be time to drop that joint so i'm very excited um they are kind of limited so hopefully if you see this video you'll be able to cop one still but if not i do apologize i don't know if they'll ever get restocked because these are silver so this is my first time doing a um, 925 silver piece, which is actually dipped in white gold as well. But yeah, this is my first time doing a silver piece. So it cost me a little bit more money than the stainless steel joints that I do, but it's okay. Um, I think it's all part of the journey. We're just trying to evolve with every drop that we do. You feel me? So um, yeah, I think that's definitely all that I got probably. Um, 
I'll probably just catch y'all in the next video, man. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and all that good stuff. And I'll be back to you more. Peace.